Now then, so about two weeks ago I opened up uh, some boxes with my, my Epic stuff in uh, and, and they were in a right old state. I've uh, been in there for years so what I've spent the last sort of week or so in between painting other things and work and whatnot, I've uh, sorted out my, my Epic Eldar army. Um, all painted up for my Anden many years ago. Um, so yeah, this is the full force and I'll, I'll quickly go through the various units now. Um, so what we've got there, uh, the first unit, that's a um, a Guardian Warhost. Um, so eight stands of Guardians, I replaced three stands with the heavy weapon platforms. Uh, and these are the original Falcon models from, from way back when. Uh, I use them as Wave Serpents. Um, uh, and they're led by a Farseer. There, that guy there with the, and the standard bearer to make them stand out. Um, the next unit across is exactly the same, uh, same again. Um, the front there, we've got six of the War Walkers, these are the original um, Road Trader sort of epic Space Marine era metal ones, and uh, little combat eggs uh, from a long, long time ago. Yep, so a detachment of six of those. Um, got the avatar of Kane. It's there. Uh, it's pretty cool. Try to give him the bloody hands, chopping down his spear shaft and stuff. Um, and then moving along. So I keep moving the camera. It's quite hard to film these six more figures. Um, got a detachment of rangers. So each stand's got between four and five. Ranges on and try to give them all camo cloaks and stuff. Yeah, so there's four stands of them. Um, next unit up is another Guardian War host, again led by a Farseer. Eight uh, stands of Guardians in total, and then three stands of Reef Guard. Uh, each one of these, I've just put three models on per base. Uh, like that. So there's three of those, and they're like a, an additional uh, buff for that for that unit. And then there's three support weapon platforms at the back there. And these original plastic ones that used to get back in the early nineties. Um, yeah, so that's that one. And then the next one along is exactly the same again. So in total, we've got four units of. Um, Guardians, or four Guardian War Hosts. Behind them, then we've got the Aspect Warriors. Uh, I apologise for the shaky camera. Um, so these are all mixed. Uh, so we've got Dire Avengers there, Striking Scorpions, uh, Alien Banshees, and then Harlequins. I'll just use these as more um, Alien Banshees, but there's the Harlequins. Got six mil ones. Uh, this one's got the attack on. He is banshees, just to make him stand out. Give him the uh, standard bearer as well. Uh, behind them, we've got four bases of swooping hawks. Uh, these are actually the XR models. For some reason I didn't have any swooping hawk models, but I had loads of these. So I just um, yeah, they'll do. Swooping hawks. Um, and then moving across, we've got five bases of Dark Reapers. Here's the new little guys here. There we go. Yeah, there's five bases of those. One of them's got an Exarch on. So that's this one here, it's got the Exarch there. Um, just slightly different. Um, and then Fire Dragons behind. Another four stands of those. There they are. And one of those has got an XR as well, which is this guy. Oops. There's the XR there. Um, next along we've got Engines of All. Uh, these are the original Tempests. Um, I think the sort of modern equivalent is the Scorpions, the heavy tanks with twin pulse cannons. I think they're called. Yeah, but these are the big metal original ones from the early 90s. Um, yeah, they're alright. 
painted them a long time ago. Uh, and then we've got four uh, wild rider hosts, I think they're called, with the bikers and the vipers. Um, I'll just show you one of those. So the bikers, uh, the original plastic ones. Not too bad, I painted these years ago, so they're all right. And then the vipers again, the original ones. They're completely different design now these days, but they were the original ones. All right. Just think back over there. And then the last thing I've got is the Phantom Titan. Yep, so there's a Phantom Titan, big metal model. Uh, well, when I bought him, uh, he only had this one arm, and I searched on an eBay for ages to get another one of these arms. Couldn't get one, but I had one of them in my bits box, so I just stuck that on. I believe that comes off the Warlock Titan. Doesn't really matter. Um, as everyone knows what it is. And then you've got the original counter there for its. I don't think they have void shows, they have like hollow fields or something. They all die. Yeah, but there you go. So that's full army. Um, what we'll do is I'll move on to my Space Marine army next and get those sorted out as well and up to the same standard as this. Um, I'll get back to you with another video. Um, thanks very much for watching uh, and I'll speak to you soon. Bye bye.